There are 76 individuals in the, uh, the Hawaii State Legislature, and only one of me. So I need people that are comfortable uh, talking to representatives and, and senators, and I go out and I look for those people. I can, do it my, I can do it myself, but there are more of them than there are of me. So I still need to supplement my, my strengths. Um, but equally as important is, is choosing people that fit your team, right? If, if um, a lot of this will take a lot of deep, deep, deep personal reflection, right? You're really gonna have to be honest about who you are, what you're good at, what you're not good at. Um, and then you're gonna have to be honest about your management style. I'm not really a micromanager, I don't like that. You know, we'll work together, I need you to do what you do, and we come back together and work it out. If you're a micromanager, you probably shouldn't choose, a, you know, you, sh you probably shouldn't choose people that are too free-spirited and that get away from you. Um, I, I like working under my micromanagers, they, you know, I'm fine with it. Um, but choosing people that fit your team are critical. And then in the, the other thing you're gonna need are people that believe in your mission, right? So in the context of, of campaigns, um, a great example was uh, Becky pointed out that, you know, when Stanley Chang was running, his team, I mean, his time was his most precious resource. So he needed to pick good individuals that understood, that believed in his message, and, and could go out there to these sort of individual uh, communities and really speak to the heart of who they are and, and get them to support him. Uh, so, you know, those are the things that I think are critical that you, you consider your weaknesses, you supplement your strengths, uh, that you find people that fit and that are really true believers of, of all that you do. Let's thank all of our speakers. That was great. Because Eleanor Roosevelt said, set a good example or it'll be a cautionary tale. So, <laughs> we can all channel our inner Eleanor uh, resign.